Hello, my name is Michael Maroots, and today I'm going to be teaching you my NASCAR driver nicknames. Many of you have been asking for this video for quite a while, so we are going to go through seven of these nicknames today. Seven, because Jemai is a seven-time champion. Will he be on the list? Oh, I guess we'll find out. Starting our countdown at number seven is Giggles Logano. If you really have to ask me why I call him Giggles Logano, then you haven't been watching NASCAR for very long at all. I bet you you'd be hard-pressed to find an interview where that man does not giggle at some point. So, Joey, today at Talladega, all four of your wheels fell off and you were catapulted into the grandstands, killing 30 seven spectators. How do you feel? <laughs> Yeah, that's unfortunate. Sixth spot coming in is a retiree. Gonna be applying for AARP here shortly. It's Redneck Jesus. I always say a little bit of a prayer to Redneck Jesus before I strap into my virtual race cars just to make sure I come out the other side safe. So many people worship the ground this man walks on, Dale Earnhardt Jr. You go into any number of infields at any racetrack and you are sure to find beer belly having rednecks with so much hair on their back where they got a three or an eight shaved into that shit. That is commitment. That is belief in something higher. Fifth place is a little bit of a shocker to many of you. I have had so many people ask me, why do you call him William Clyde? Well, because that's his name. Chase Elliott, number five. Go on to Wikipedia and you will find the truth. You had no idea all this time you've been supporting a guy with the middle name Clyde? His first name might as well be Cletus. Cletus Clyde Chase William Elliott the third. I could see the flags flying at the racetrack already. Fourth goes to Martin Truex Jr. T-Rex, I don't know what a Truex is. I don't know where a Truex is from. Is that like a Scandinavian name? No, it's not. It's Swedish. When I look at it, I can picture Gennaro about to be bitten in half on the toilet. Third spot, it's the hack. No, it's Denny Hamster. Hamlin. I, I guess I should start with like their actual name. So you know who I'm talking about. Hamster, Hamlin, what's the difference? Hamsters are second in class in the rodent game, probably second only to rats. Hamlin, well, he's second to everybody. Plus he kind of looks like a hamster. Ah, ha, ha! Second place is one of my personal favorites. It's Kyle Bush, baby, bushy, bushy, bitch! The origins of this one are to remain anonymous, mostly because I don't remember them. My best guess, I call him bushy, bushy, bitch. The bitch part throws back to the way he was back in the 2010 era. 2010, 2015, maybe a little before that. 08, 09, he was a big bitch. As time has gone on though, I have softened my stance a little bit and I haven't used the bitch as much. I'm still gonna throw one out there from time to time because it just rolls right off the tongue. Try it with me, bushy, bushy, bitch. It just feels good. Now, where did the bushy, bushy come from? I caught a peek in the showers. Less, but certainly not least, because this is a countdown from seventh all the way to first and we're on first now. It's Jemai! Now, where did Jemai originate? I'm 100% sure that it came from my excitement levels whenever I see him. It wasn't always this way in all of my videos. You could hear me in some videos just calling him Jimmy. Jimmy Johnson, you're the greatest ever. Oh, God, that makes my insides quiver. As time went on, though, I realized my true love for him and the excitement when I'd see him out on the track reached paramount levels where it skewed the way I would say his name. First it was Jimmy, then it was Jimmy, it was Jimmy, and it was Jimmy! I'm fully aware he doesn't have an A or a Y at the end of his name. That's gonna do it for me today, everybody. Seventh to first. If you want me to do another one of those, then leave a like, one of those. They still count on YouTube. I've got so many nicknames to get through, so if you want more, we'll do more. Thank you guys for watching. I love every single last one of you. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye, Jimmy!